Hey there, shipmates. This is Rebel John Kirby, Chief of Information. I wanted to talk to you a little bit about some budget issues today. I know you've been tracking the news and you're aware that, uh, that we averted the fiscal cliff, at least temporarily, but that Congress still has a couple months to work on sequestration. If sequestration is enacted, it certainly would be devastating to the military across the board, and that includes the Navy. But there's also another fiscal issue here that I want to make sure you know we're tracking, and that's called a continuing resolution. We do not have appropriated funds for fiscal year 13. So you've seen that the president signed the authorization bill for the fiscal year 13 National Defense Authorization Act. But that authorizes uh, certain programs. It does not put money against it. We still need an appropriations bill from Congress for fiscal year 13. We don't have that. Now we have a new Congress that the, the last Congress didn't act on it. The new Congress has yet to act on it. So because of that, we're operating under what we call a continuing resolution, a CR. That CR is, is funded at fiscal year $12. It also includes some overseas uh, contingency operation funding, but not enough to get us through the entire next fiscal year. Uh, so you're going to be hearing us talk about this a little bit more and more, and we're going to keep you completely informed. But I wanted to make sure that at least I planted the seed out there, that this that operating under a continuing resolution for the whole year is not very healthy for the Navy. It's not very healthy for the Marine Corps either, or any of the services, quite frankly. And we're going to keep you informed. You're going to hear a little bit more about this as we go along. But I wanted to make sure I laid that out there as an issue of concern. Thanks, and we'll keep you updated.